won the New York City half against a, a, a good field, you know, also help your confidence and maybe any thoughts you might have about Shalane Flanagan, yeah. who's you know, the top U.S. runner and making her marathon to the Yeah. Um, the New York half marathon, I was coming second by a long way and then eventually I caught up Dina Castor in the last mile and overtook her and won. So that um, that really showed me that I can hold it against the really big stars and, and, and win. So I want to try and, although Shalane and Mary Katani and some of the others, they're, they're really top runners, I, I want to go there not afraid of them. Um, in terms of Shalane doing her marathon debut, <clears throat> when I won the 2008 Osaka marathon, uh, Fukushi Kayako also ran and she, she's known as the queen of the track in Japan. She's holds numerous Japanese records, represented Japan at the Olympics over 10,000 meters several times. and. She, there were high expectations of her. She flew off at like 220 speed and I caught her up at 34k and overtook her and won. So, but before the race, of course, I thought, wow, you know, she's this awesome 10k runner. She's going to do brilliantly. So, after that experience, what I say is you, you just do not know with people doing their first marathon. They could be fabulous. They couldn't could be a disaster you just really don't know and I, so that's that's how I how I look at Shalane and Mary they're both fabulous runners over the shorter distances uh, I really don't underestimate them I wouldn't be surprised if they run you know near the course record or run brilliantly but at the same time you don't know what they're going to be like as marathon runners so I just have to focus on my own race do run the best I can and if that's good enough to beat them, I'll be over the moon. <laughs>